Here we've ingested Salesforce data into Sentinel Data Lake via the available connector, which allows for higher fidelity relationship mapping to instantiate a custom multi-cloud identity graph and that our agent is connected to. This time I'll ask, can you analyze Alberto Pollock using the custom identity graph? Is there risk to Salesforce? And the agent uses the identity graph. It's getting information to understand potential attack paths. Then it finds the blast radius specific to Alberto. Then it's searching for Salesforce specific connections and runs more queries in different ways against the data lake. You'll see that it found Alberto to be high risk based on his access level. We can see clearly that Alberto is a help desk tier one admin with admin rights who can delegate privileges to other accounts and even APIs and perform remote script execution. This goes beyond information that can be queried in Microsoft Entra ID. This could lead to privilege escalation and bulk data exfiltration via API data sync. Under direct Salesforce risk, it lists risky things that his account can do managing users, modifying all data, and again, the API privileges. Then it highlights attack scenarios with single sign-on compromise and the API. Lastly, it gives great immediate recommendations. These ones are at a critical level focused on reducing Alberto's access levels, including his group memberships, enabling just-in-time elevation to limit standing privileges, and auditing connected apps to make sure they have not been compromised. 